Hello and welcome to question one of the 8300 sample paper for Higher Mathematics non-calculator page. It's Higher Mathematics and Statistics. In this question we're asked, circle the calculation that increases 400 by 7%. It's only worth one mark, so we're not looking to overthink this. The first thing you should probably do is eliminate stupid answers when you're looking at multiple choice. And the key word here is increases. So we're looking for anything that will result in a number less than 400 and we can eliminate that as a stupid answer. So if you're multiplying 400 times 0 0.07 you're going to end up with a number less than 400. So let's get rid of that. That as it turns out is the formula to calculate 7% of 400 and we want to increase by um, 400 by 7%. So we're going to want 400 times 0 0.07 but we also need to add 400 to that. Here 400 times 0 0.7 well that's 7 over 10 which is 70 over 100 so that's going to find 70% of 400 and we don't want that either because that's going to be less than 400. So our choice is between 400 times 1.07 and 400 times 1.7. Well if we're taking 400 plus 400 times 0.07 If we want to simplify this, we can factor out that 400, and that is equal to 400 into, that 400 becomes a 1, plus 0 0.07, because 400 times 0 0.707, if we factor out the 400, what's wrong with me, that decimal point should have gone there. Okay, so that's 400 times 1.07, so this is the correct answer. And this answer here would have increased 400 by 70%, so that's not the correct answer. Looking at question 2, three to simplify 3 to the power of 4 times 3 to the power of 4, well that's just your law of indices, isn't it? So let's say a to the power n multiplied by a to the power m where a is the base n and m are both indices that's just equal to a to the power n plus m so we're looking at 3 to the power 4 plus 4 so that's just 3 to the power 8. And that's your correct answer. Circle the area that is the same as 5.5 meters squared. Well that is equal to 5.5 meters by 1 meter. 5.5 times 1 is 5.5 and meters times meters. Or we could have square, done the square root of 5.5 times the square root of 5.5 but it's easy to just think of a like a long carpet that's 5.5 meters long by 1 meter wide. And that meters and meters will multiply together. So that is equal to, if we're converting that to, meet, to centimeters, there are 100 centimeters in a meter. So this is equal to 550, that's just 5.5 times 100, the decimal point goes two places to the right, 550 centimetres by 1 metre, which is 100 centimetres. Which is equal to 550 Again, moving the decimal point two places to the right, we're just sticking two noughts on the end. 
zero zero and centimeters times centimeters is centimeters squared so if we um, put our comma in whatever that's 55,000 centimeters squared in 5.5 .5 meters squared so our answer is this one and that's our first three questions done hope that was helpful and I'll see you in the next set of videos.